how is it um, frustrating on the defensive end? And we talked about it all year with you guys, and it just continues to be kind of a problem. Yeah, I mean, today was a that was a perfect example that you know, obviously we had, we had uh, problems on that end, defensive end, um, and if we want to you know to continue win games, we gotta fix it ASAP because it didn't look good. You know, we, we always talk about stats uh, and and st- that stuff like that, but it just it didn't look good today, and that was that was the main concern. Like our like our aggressiveness level wasn't wasn't where we we're supposed to be. And I think we didn't we didn't give 100 percent effort on that end. Do you have talent on this team? Why do you think you guys can't put a full game together for a complete 40 minutes? That's a good question. That we're still trying to figure it out. It's not we don't have the the, the answer, but you know we're just trying to fix it like step by step by step. Uh, I think we need to. You can't just blame one person. It's the whole team. It's a it's a completely collective uh, defense. We we have to. Just play aggressive, more aggressive as a team. What's I, the biggest difference on both sides of the ball? And as a senior, I'm curious. Mm-hmm. Four teams you've played with. What is so different about this team as compared to the other teams? I mean, we, we practice the same way that we practiced the last four years. We didn't change anything. Uh, we don't do new stuff. It's everything pretty much same. But like I said, I think a lot of times it, it comes to like our effort and aggressiveness. You know. I think even even tonight we had a f- few good possessions that we didn't finish all the way till the end when they scored in the last four or five seconds or when we fouled. So th- th- those are the small details that that really hurt us a lot. We need we need we need to fix them as soon as possible. Are you are you worried? I mean, what? Are you worried about the, the, the trajectory your team is going right now? I mean, it all it all depends how we where we go from here. You know, obviously we have a tough stretch of games. We play uh, USC. They're a really good team. Then we got ASU, Oregon school, and I think we need to answer the, the bell right now. You know, if we don't do it, it's not gonna be. It's gonna get ugly. So uh, it's up to us to change something. You know, we have to bounce back, like I said, as soon as possible because the next game is, is on Saturday. So we have to change something r- really quick. Where do you guys go from here? I mean, we just have to, you know, play more aggressive. You know. And even like have more fun. I don't think like even today we didn't enjoy the game. We were like worried not to lose instead of just trying to win. And that, that that's the difference maker. I think everybody needs to understand that this is just, this is just the game, and you have to you have to have fun playing it. You know, uh, if you worry about like making mistakes, then you're gonna keep doing keep making mistakes. So like. From from this point on, we need to just you know get better. You know we have to even next game we have to show that we we we're on the right track. I, I think we are. I think we like I said we're doing exactly the same thing that we've been doing for the four four last four years. We just have to like actually show it on the court. What sense of confidence level has dropped at all among the team wide at least, not yourself necessarily? I mean, may, you can make an argument that maybe our confidence level dropped to, tonight, but I, I think we'll be fine next game. Uh, it's only like a long-term thing, well, a short-term thing. So, I'll think we'll, we'll fix it. We have to fix it. We don't have a choice. We don't have, we don't have like 20 games left in the season. What's what's Sean's mood with you guys? I mean, he comes in here and he's not bad or he's not upset. He just kind of says it like it was. Is he, how is he with you guys? I mean, I don't know. We, we just met briefly, so we'll, we'll see tomorrow. But obviously, he's not happy. I mean, nobody's happy on the team right now, and we don't we don't lose games at home like like this. You know, this is this is I think Parker's and mine's like third time that we, we lost at home, and it's one of the worst feelings in the world. And obviously, nobody's happy, but we have to we have to bounce back ASAP. Does it compare at all to the Bahamas thing a little bit? I mean, you guys seem to make a ton of progress since then, but in some ways, maybe defensively. I mean, if we if we fix the, if we fix our defense on Saturday, then, uh, then uh, I, I, we will actually show that we learned something Bahamas, you know. Yeah. So uh, it doesn't look like it right now, but it's all about where we where we where we're gonna go from from this point on.